Still in the news, despite the ongoing strike by the National Association of Resident Doctors, its chapter at the Lagos University Teaching Hospital, Luth, has converged to discuss challenges and the way forward in the sector. At the event, Commissioner for Health, Ikiti State, Dr. Oyebanji Filani says, in order to reform the Nigerian healthcare system, there is need to understand the challenges with a view to preferring possible solutions. Plus TV Africa's correspondent, Mercy Ebopo, has more in this report. The event, which is held virtually and in real time, has a huge attendance of resident doctors, prominent medical practitioners, among others. Its theme, reforming the Nigerian healthcare for sustainable development. During his keynote address, Commissioner for Health, Ikiti State, Dr. Yebanji Felani speaks of the problems faced by the health sector. He says having an understanding of the issue is paramount. In one sentence, I have attempted to summarize the challenge of the Nigerian health sector as a misalignment of our health system functions and goals. Conceptually, there are three health system goals. The first is health, which simply means improving and maintaining the health population, health of the population. The second is responsiveness, which focuses on how well the system, the health system as a whole, meets the expectations of the population. And of course, the third is financial protection, which ensures that you and I and every household in Nigeria can go to bed knowing that at any point in time they use healthcare, it would not lead them to financial ruin. Dr. Yebanji Filani also says government cannot be left out of the equation of providing health care services. Meanwhile, General Secretary Association of Resident Doctors, Lagos University Teaching Hospital, Dr. Samuel O'Kearing Day, says the conference has spawned out of the need to salvage the health sector, which is in a critical state. The other thing, some of what I've mentioned as well in my presentation, is the role of stewardship ensuring that that stewardship, the ability to finance healthcare, and investments that we made in human and fiscal resources for health allow us to, you know, to strengthen service delivery and enable us to be able to improve healthcare for the, for the population. We need a reformation. We need a, uh, of the, heads, uh, the total health sector, okay, um, as regarding financing, what are the innovative, what are the sustainable, what are the collaborative ways of sustaining, which is a fact that the government alone cannot finance healthcare. So we need to begin to think of other ways in which healthcare can be um, financed, hence the need for this program. Some of the participants are of the opinion that government should broaden its tax net to widen its revenue sources as it looks towards diversifying its economy and also improve funding for the health sector. Messi Bokbo for Plus TV Africa. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.